What if I told you there's a machine so powerful, it can suck in air at nearly the speed of sound, compress it 30 times, and blast it out with enough force to shatter concrete? This isn't science fiction. This is the GEF-110, the jet engine that's kept American air dominance razor sharp for decades. And in the next few minutes, you'll see why this engine isn't just powerful. It's brutal, efficient, and built to dominate the skies. So stick around, because what's under this casing will blow your mind. You've probably seen fighter jets roar overhead, but have you ever stopped to ask, what actually makes them scream? The heart of that roar, especially on the legendary F-16 Fighting Falcon and F-15 Eagle, is this, the General Electric F-110. Developed during the Cold War and still flying high today, the F-110 changed the rules of air combat with one major promise. More thrust, less maintenance. Let's break that down. Fast. This beast pumps out 29,000 pounds of thrust in full afterburner. That's enough power to launch a fully loaded fighter jet vertically. Inside, a nine-stage high-pressure compressor spins at over 11,000 RPM, squeezing air into a near-liquid state before it explodes into forward thrust. Oh, and the turbine blades? They're made from heat-resistant alloys that survive temperatures hotter than lava. That's not an exaggeration. The internal core of the F-110 hits 3,500 degrees Fahrenheit during operation. Now imagine designing something to survive that, spin at max speeds, and not melt. It's like trying to build a blender that lives inside a volcano and never breaks. Meanwhile, your kitchen blender screams just making a smoothie. But raw numbers don't win wars. Reliability does. The F-110 wasn't just designed to go fast. It was designed to keep going, no matter what. Compared to older engines, it slashed maintenance time by nearly 40%. Why? Because GE designed it with modular construction, meaning damaged sections can be swapped in hours, not days. Pilots call it the engine you forget is there, and that's the ultimate compliment. And here's something most people don't know. This engine helped keep U.S. jets flying during the Gulf War, Balkan conflicts, and even modern deployments through sand, salt, and sub-zero missions. But wait until you hear how the F-110 stacks up against modern 5th-gen power plants and why it's still not obsolete. Today, the F-110 powers the most advanced versions of the F-15X, and yes, it's been upgraded. GE didn't just rest on its Cold War legacy. They modernized the control systems, added digital engine diagnostics, and fine-tuned fuel efficiency. That means pilots today are flying with 1980s muscle, backed by 2020s intelligence. And here's where things get real. There's talk of this engine evolving even further, not being replaced, but rebuilt into hybrid propulsion systems that could power drones, six-gen fighters, or even orbital assist craft. Because when an engine can survive that much heat, pressure, and stress, the sky's not the limit anymore. It's just the starting line. Now think about it. Your car engine dies if you skip an oil change. This thing flies for thousands of hours while igniting explosions on purpose. Makes you wonder who really builds the better engine, huh? So, what's next for the F-110? That's a story still being written, in the air and maybe even beyond Earth. Subscribe because next time we're going even deeper into the engines built to outfly missiles, outsmart radar, and redefine air superiority. Trust me, you won't want to miss that.